So, sorry for the last part, I, I stopped. So let's continue. Okay. Uh, er, I forgot where my lash is, this one right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you're gonna copy this one to the pimples, okay? Copy this one to the pimples. Man, what is the thing? It's, it's this one. Clipping here. Press enter. And that's how you do it. Like this. So it will, like, it won't, it will be in the scar like this. So let's show this one. So that's how it works, okay? gonna do is moving the hands hands here well this is gonna be a different way so um, you can rename it if you want but I prefer not to rename it okay so here is the hand You can move this one first, but you wonder how can you move it? You move it like, uh, like this, but of course it's not. It's not that easy, bro. So you're gonna choose a rotation deformer. Here you're just gonna name it whatever you want. Just okay. So um. You can choose these, but I prefer not this one. So you have to move this one, right? But you cannot move it. You found out that ah, oh, you cannot move it. But there's a different way to move it. Press your computer, which is like C T R L dot thingy, and then press. Just use your mouse to move it. Press this. Press the button here and you can move it to the place you want to rotate that means it's the middle point so here it is as you see so you're gonna move this thing too continue pressing that button and move to the place which is right This is where, how we can move it. Uh, like this. You can move like this right now. Easy, right? not that hard this part so choose one that you want uh, I'm not gonna rename this one because I'm too lazy you know uh, mm, so for example you're doing this steam use the keyforms wait you're going here so it's gonna move see because this one you're not adjusting it so that's why when you like here it will go here and here is the point that you want to move right so if you did not adjust that so it's just go back to the original um, place where it belongs 
Okay. Not hard. So, let's go to the hand. Who? Hand time. We're gonna move it. We're gonna move both of them. Oops, sorry. Okay, so that's why we're gonna select both of them. And how can you do it? Do it over here. Wait, I'm gonna find out. here so press the shift button and then press them two together that's how you do it so go to rotation again create another rotation and do the same thing go to the rotation point to do the same thing and I know it's kind of annoying this part and that's how you move your hand, like this. Ooh, it still looks pretty weird, right? Okay, I'm still gonna move it a little bit until it looks pretty normal. Be patient. Do I maybe have to? Oh, oh my God! Just oops. Make a little rotation here. Okay, so. How you do it? Still use the key form. Key flames. Sorry. Okay. Still gonna create three of them. Of course, normal. And you're gonna still like. So remember to move it like um, when you're in the second key form, you're gonna follow the second key form to the point. So, or or your hand will be like, you know, like this. Sometimes separate. Okay. So you're gonna move it. Move it over there. Like this. So let's start to have a have a little turn this. Oh man. Okay, so we're still gonna go back here. See, it looks so weird, right? Okay, and this is why this part is. This part. Ah, went. Um, can I stick this two thing together? Serve this. Okay, wait. 
Ah, I messed up everything. Ah. gonna move like this. It looks pretty weird. Ah, I don't know why. Ah, yeah, I actually kind of... I guess I'm gonna stick these two things together. For a moment, I guess I'm gonna stick this together. Oh, I forgot to show you guys one more thing. <sighs> I forgot to show you guys. Okay, press the shift button here. You're gonna choose all of this stuff right here and create a new parameter so for this one it's gonna move all of these stuff and it's much better oh <laughs> it's so weird oh man okay i'm gonna still gonna create a rotation Select this thing. Okay. Wait. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. I'm selecting this. Not this, bruh. can just select this things. Ah. Oh wait, I'm just gonna delete this rotation. Wait, did I delete my hand? Oh, back, oh, it's back here. Uh, move it back up, please. So, uh, I'm gonna do like, I'm gonna create a rotation which is which is um wait. Ah well, where did this stuff go? Oh okay, like Alright. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna create all of this. You're gonna know. Um I'm doing one which is which is moving all of this stuff together. So it's gonna look better. You see it's moving all of this stuff together. It's gonna look like this. Okay, I'm gonna put the put it until it looks normal. I know you guys are kind of annoying right now, right? Remember to press the button first. Okay. That's how you move this thing. Okay. 
So we're going to do this perimeter. We're going to move it out. Wait, I guess I have to set up the right place. Okay, so let's just move like this. So it's gonna look like this. I'm gonna separate the hand like this again. <laughs> I'm doing it all over again. Okay, select both of these things, or if you just select this one, it'll move like like this. It looks so weird, right? So you're gonna, you're not gonna just select this. Press the shift button again to select both of these things. And do a rotation for the firmer again. Okay. Looks pretty weird. It's a perfect point. Okay, I'm guessing moving this way is better. Okay, I guess this one is almost at the perfect point. So you're gonna do another key form again and go back here, of course. So you will see this two stuff stick together. So it be normal. Okay, finally it looks a little normal. Okay, wait. I'm gonna move this. You see? It's moving like pretty good. So same with the other hand. So I'm gonna, I'm not gonna repeat this step anymore. It's really, really, really annoying. So let's go with her head. So her head. Mm hmm. We're gonna select everything on her head, right? <laughs> Sorry. Select everything. 
everything. Remember, everything. That's all what's on her head, bro. Oh, I forgot the back here. It's Move it up, please. <sighs> Wait, what did I put it here? Oh, I forgot that I... I forgot to delete the screen right here. Select everything with this. Oh yes, I did it. Okay, here we go, guys. We're gonna rotate her head. Same. Use rotation deformer. This one, this one. Okay. So still gonna put that thing over there. Put it in the middle. So that's how it moves. Uh -huh. Okay, create, create, keyframes. You see, her hand moves like this. I'm gonna try to animate this thing. So next, you're moving her eyeball. Wait, let's open her eyes first. You're moving her eyeball. So it looks like this, right? It's going to be like pretty weird. Okay. So it's same, just uh, the eyeball is not nothing to say actually it's just moving around like that like this and it will move you see I'm gonna go back here yeah nothing special just moving the eyeball like this Okay, I guess I'm doing a, I'm not doing great as the results of that one, right? <laughs> okay, next we're gonna move her legs. Here we go. and making screenshots. I just didn't want to change to this. And I find that the animating is fun, but actually it takes a lot of time. Okay. Rotation deformer again. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Remember the circle should be not too big. It's just about that size of the thing, okay? So let's try and move it.
Okay. I haven't moved the whole lake in my previous video, so I'm gonna do it right now. <sighs> okay. So, still, you're gonna make a. Da, da, da. Uh, I'm just gonna add a new one. Name it whatever you want. Okay, parameter. So still stay normal like this. I'm gonna go here and then actually move a little. Another rotation deformer. Make sure to follow all the steps because it's gonna be very complicated if you don't know how to use it, okay? Okay. Uh, because I'm not gonna repeat the other one, I mean the other foot again, okay? Lake. I'm guessing I'm moving this one a little bit up. You can use the mash form again. Like, what I mean is. This is how her, she moves like this. Her legs. Like this. Okay. Oh, it hurts me so much. Spend all my time doing this thing. Oh my gosh. So. Okay, time for the hair. Wait. Okay, I guess this one. Oh, yeah. 
so. Uh, it's just this one to hand. Oh wait, this one is. Oh, this one is the hand. So, let's use this one then. Okay. So at first we're gonna stay normal like this. So we'll go here, and then her head just stay right here, right? So it's probably the hair is gonna bit down. So which is gonna be like this, or if you wanna make it smoother, what I mean is, so we're gonna use this mesh form, create, and right here you can create like this thing can move like this, and then it will be like. This. you see so I'm moving like this I'm moving like when she when she just um, move her ha move her head uh, down a little bit so she'll be like this her hair go down over here I'm doing this you gotta want me right Oh wait, I forgot to select a new parameter. Okay, okay. Uh, I can only use... Move, yeah. Uh. Let's move this one back too. This one, oh no, it's not this one. This one is the head, right? Okay. Okay, well, let's do it again. Like this. I forgot to tell you, there's one more tip for you when you can use this. When you do something wrong and you want to reverse, you can pr you can press the reverse button, which is on your computer. Press that um, C T R L button, and then you press. Uh, I mean, you hold that one, and then you press the set on your computer. Okay, that's how you do it. So let's see the results. Oops, sorry, I forgot to make that for normal. When it is normal, I can make that. Though. Oh, the eye looks weird. Okay, I have to. Let's see if the eye looks weird. I guess it's not because it's gonna be fast. So these are the um, basic things. <laughs> oh my gosh. I spent millions of years in this. Um, I guess that's how you do it. So how to save it? Yeah, how to save it? I have to talk about this. Yeah. First, um, let me show you something. Um, uh, if you want to save it, uh, wait. 
just press here but if you want to say how to save it as a video then it's gonna be here there's a little rip on it here you see that um, so when you start it and you press this one it's gonna record this and then after you do that okay but first let me do that Okay, wait, I have to save this thing first. For this thing, I'm gonna save randomly. Okay, it's recording. Recording right now? So after everything is done, we're gonna just, we're just gonna... And here, it will show you this. And then you can like we in here and then it's gonna record all your um, order steps here but here is a place where you can animate to so after you do that that's all you have to do after you do that just press this one and press this go to video and that's how you save it and of course you can choose the the um, size that you want uh, so that's all I'm, that's all I have to, do, to tell you and thank you so much for watching this video and being patient to me to the end I hope you didn't skip it right <laughs> if you skip it I'm gonna be like Oh man, why well, did this give I I spent all my hard work like this. Okay, so um thank you so much for watching. I hope you don't think this is a useless thing and I, and I hope you learn something. Because I'm a beginner too. I learned it like two days before I made this video. I mean I mean before I made the the testing video, you know. Uh and I, I only learned the basics. Okay, I hope I hope I can help you more with animation too, because I'm gonna next I'm gonna teach you how to switch this hands and how to switch eyes, and these are the parts that may be a little harder, but I'll try to learn it myself so I can teach more people to learn. Thank you. See you in the next video. Bye.